Hey guys, in this video I want to do some test to see what is the effect of power factor on the inverter battery runtime. I found some guys that asking about the effect of power factor on the inverter battery, but after many years there are no good answer to their questions. The power factor is a number between 1 and 0 that refers to the phase shaft between voltage phase and current phase in AC appliances. The power in DC devices is equal to voltage times current, but the power in AC devices is equal to voltage times current times power factor. Assuming we have two AC appliances and both they are consuming 220 watts of power, but the power factor in the first device is 1 and the power factor in the second device is 0.5. In this case, according to this formula, the first device is drawing 1 amp of current, but the second device is drawing 2 amps of current. So the load with less power factor drawing more current. However, the power consumption in the both AC appliances are the same. Here I have two LED lamps with the same power. Both they are consuming 15 watt of power, but the power factor in the first lamp is equal to 0 0.63. And the power factor in the second lamp is very close to 1. So the first lamp with less power factor drawing 105 milliamp of current. But the second LED lamp with higher power factor drawing only 66 milliamp of current. Here I have this power inverter and this supercapacitor bank. I charge my supercapacitor bank to 14 volt and connect it to the power inverter. First I want to connect the LED lamp with less power factor to the inverter. Then I connect the second one with higher power factor to see which of them drain the supercapacitor faster. First I run in my LED lamp with power factor of 0.6 to see how long it takes to drain the supercapacitor bank. By the way, you can find out the links of the supercapacitor bank and the stopwatch in the description of this video. As you can see, it takes 1 minute and 55 seconds. And this time, running the second LED lamp with Unity Power Factor. This time, as you can see, the LED lamp with higher power factor drained the supercapacitor bank after 1 minute and 58 seconds. So 36% more power factor increasing the runtime of the inverter only 2.5%. Here I have this tiny AC motor. Its power is 15 watt and drawing 116 milliamp of current and the power factor is 0.55. According to this online PFC capacitor calculator, I have to connect 1.3 microfarad capacitor with the motor to increase the power factor from 0.55 to 1. As you can see here, by connecting the capacitor to the motor, the power factor becomes very close to 1. And the current drawing drops from 116 milliamp to only 66 milliamp. First, I charge the supercapacitor bank to 14 volt and connect the motor to the inverter without power factor correction capacitor. As you can see, it's drained the supercapacitor after 1 minute and 58 seconds. I repeat this test and this time using power factor correction capacitor. This time the motor drained the supercapacitor after 2 minutes and 8 seconds. So increasing the inductive load power factor by 43%, increased the inverter runtime by 7.8%. So I can see significant change in the inverter runtime before and after power factor correction. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.